hello welcome back today is tuesday recital hit me pretty hard so yesterday took all day to do everything i needed to do today i've done the same thing just got out of the bath it's two i don't have my glasses on yet two o'clock right now we have some family getting into town and so we're actually going to go over to my in-laws house for probably just like an hour and honestly it's much easier for me to like go into this slowly versus like all day every day and so really excited to go meet them or go see them and meet my newest niece so that'll be fun um i just tried on a christmas gift <laughs> kyle's gonna end up giving me um but i was trying it on to see because got this like green um it says mock turtleneck but it's pretty high but i like it um turtleneck and i most likely for like Christmas, I probably would wear like sweats over it like this. So I'm actually going to change into something else just because I think I want to wear this for our Christmas, but I like it. I'm going to go meet our new niece, say hi to our family, and then I'm going to come home and do my very best to get some presents wrapped because, because I would really like to enjoy a few days with the presents under the tree. Just not felt up to it yet. So gonna do that and then I only have a few days before our Christmas starts, so it'll be a good time. So oh, I need to make some food because we're gonna leave in like 10 minutes and I'm not even close to being ready, so I'm gonna air fry these leftover green beans. I had a hot dog. There I do. Tonight I'm gonna stop over. Thankfully she has some groceries. Oh, I know what I need to do. So I was gonna make like sausages, that's why I wasn't really wanting to make that hot dog. I'd have to ask her if she does. But I was gonna just do like sausages and vegetables in the oven. My back has been like screaming at me ever since I got out of the bath. Still trying to figure out what to wear. I just tried on clothes for way too long, having a really hard time trying to figure out what to wear. You know, it's hard when you don't feel well, You've, you wanna be comfortable. Uh, it's a little tricky. Okay, found something comfortable enough for now. <laughs> that was really frustrating. It's just hard when you want to conserve your energy, but I just went with the black jeans and then this really comfy, big, slouchy shirt. Have to tuck it in because there's about 20 holes on it, but it's comfortable. <laughs> We're laughing because there's like these huge buildings up and we're what, three minutes away from the house right now? Yeah, about that. And I have never seen them before. I've not been this way since what, June? Probably. The wedding? Yeah, unfortunately. But oh my goodness, it's just insane. I never would have guessed that those would be up there, you know? Mm -hmm. It's weird. It's. Okay, we are heading back now. That was a nice visit. We're gonna stop and pick up off of my parents' porch just um, some vegetables and sausage so I can make for dinner tonight and then so glad to go even if it's just for like an hour or an hour and a half because I don't get to see them often and this is what I need a short visit so hope to see them um, a few more times throughout the week before like our actual Christmas and stuff okay we got the goods sausages Christmas gifts Okay, getting the candles on, getting it nice and cozy. Luna has had her fun over here, as you can see. <laughs> and I am going to start dragging out all the Christmas stuff. I have a few out here already, but and Luna has knocked some ornaments down, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> I would show you what I purchased. Normally I don't do this, but I've wa I was watching a couple other vlogs. And I was like, you know what? It's kind of fun to see. So this year for some of our family, um, we drew names. I don't open, but I have so many packages that are unopened. I need to open and make sure they're the correct things. First off, we have this hydro flask. A couple hydro flasks this year. This one is a Black Friday sale, which honestly, I'm pretty sure everything I bought was a Black Friday sale. It's a Hydro Flask, 12 ounce, and this is 16 ounce, and it says it fits in a coffee mug, or in a car, it fits in a car thing. Are you hungry? Some of my nieces, some little books off their baby registries that were still there. Organic cotton washcloths. A little baby beanie sweatpants. My brother and sister-in-law that are having the baby, they didn't ask for stuff for them, so that's why there's so many baby things. <laughs> Cheap. I'm gonna open this, but this is, it's like a green to cover it. I'll 
I'll just turn it this way. A green soft and black flannel for my dad. Oh. Kyle and I keep things very small for each other. So it like stuff for stockings, giving him this. Shirt from Amazon. I'll have all these things linked in my reaches recently purchased but this was like a really thick nice quality flannel like wallet thing gift cards two lunch boxes this year that's funny lunch box some jewelry this is actually my favorite like little piece it's from amazon it's really funny because my mom asked for the same thing and she didn't even know it's the same one i have so they had them on like half off on black friday if i can get it open A two set. You've probably seen me wear it before. Two chains. One, these cute little dots on it, and then, oops, and then one with a little circle. Also on sale for Black Friday. Again, these things are linked to my Amazon storefront. The people on my list ask for lunch boxes. Let's make sure I know whose is whose. Another hydro flask. This one's also 16 ounces, just a different kind my mom from my dad too this is not from me but this was another one so i'll like have stuff sent to my house or my parents will have stuff sent to their house depending on you know you don't want people to see it so that gold shirt okay and then lastly what i have here to show is this cardigan i'm not going to open it up um it's this greenish blue cardigan i also have it in black my mom can choose um, if she wants it or not. So I have that for my mom. I think that's all I have for now to show. I'm gonna get starting to wrapping, getting some Christmas um, music going. And then these were a very sweet gift from a student. So I'm going to include one with each gift as well. Let's get, I think I'm gonna start the food in the oven and we'll get some Christmas movies on, I think, and get to wrapping slowly throughout this evening, but it'll be quick for you guys. break because I am fading really really fast okay I'm not doing well so I have to stop unfortunately okay my battery died anyway but I'm not feeling well I got like six gifts wrapped almost seven and I just I can't do it anymore I'm kind of bummed but that's okay maybe this evening or tomorrow I have time the food is cooking I'm about to pull it out to put some seasonings on it and stir it a little bit but I'm gonna eat, get warm. I can tell that I'm really, um, really, really struggling. So I need to stop. Um, I've probably needed to stop for a while, but stopping now, listening to my body, and I'm gonna be done. So I'll see you guys soon. Okay, good morning. Um, this is the next day. Today is, what is today? Tuesday. And I've had a really rough morning, but I um, felt like I could get up for a little bit now. I was just so overdone from yesterday and I think still from recitals. And as you guys know, I, I think I've said before how like usually whatever your main symptom is, you know, that can change. You usually have like one thing or a bunch of little things. Sometimes it's my neck, sometimes it's my back. Past couple months, it's been a constant inflamed back which as you can imagine makes it hard to do like anything. Your arms are connected to your back, your neck's connected to your back, obviously. So when I use my arms, when I use, you know, it it just, it still hurts. It makes everything hurt and kind of go out of place. Oh, so, I should put this in. So from just being up and doing things at the dance recital, I didn't think it was too, too bad, but then yesterday, when I was getting ready, I, I told you guys I started struggling, and then as much as I loved it holding a baby, you know, that's a very difficult thing for me, just, you know, made me sore, and then, so today I woke up with a very stiff, sore neck, and then my back has just been screaming still. So, um, it's okay though, it's just how it goes, and I'm trying to still find joy in today. Like I said, this morning's been pretty tough, but feeling like I can get up and get moving a little bit and I'm gonna try to go on a walk today too. So I think I said this yesterday, I literally only got this much wrapped because it just hurts so much and 
that's been a little bit of a bummer just because I enjoy wrapping and doing this stuff so much. Do it little bits at a time. Maybe you'll get one wrap today. Maybe you'll get them all wrapped today. Maybe I'll do it and then do some more in four hours. It just, it's going to just depend and that's all right. We're going to have a good day. I hope that you can find the joy in today. Even if you, like me, are in lots of pain or don't feel good or if you're struggling with something or you feel, feel alone or just uncomfortable, I'm so sorry and I just want you to know that you are not alone and that um, other people understand the fight that you are going through. We're going to keep it relaxed today. No makeup. We're just going to stay. Um, and I just changed into some little Christmas PJs. Let's get to wrapping. Okay, I still have about three more to do, but getting close and I need a little break. But I got them wrapped. Names underneath their chocolates will be their uh, names this year. So behind this, um, I thought I had forgotten whose was whose, so I had to unwrap this a second. But it's because I forgot I had wrapped Kyle's little gift. So, Kyle's, don't forget. I'm gonna write that name next. <laughs> You can definitely tell that Luna has been playing in the tree. <laughs> now you cannot open these, Missy. Finished and I have got to be done. Um, cats look like they really want to unwrap them, so if Kyle goes back to his parents, I might have him take them. Family Christmas is supposed to be this Friday, but we're supposed to have a nice storm, so it might get changed to Monday. If they're bad with them, we might have to put them up in a room. <laughs> but I got them done though and can enjoy the tree. It's two o'clock, I need to take some herbs, and I'm gonna probably be down the rest of the day doing detox and recovering and making food and all that stuff. So I'll talk to you guys. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so I'll talk to you guys soon. Okay, just finished my walk. It's now five o'clock, and I am gonna make my popcorn for the day. I was reading on Instagram from I think it's Food Babe, you guys probably know about her, but she always like talks about like healthy swaps and everything like that. Well, how popcorn has like, sorry I'm out of breath from my walk, um, toxic chemicals like the um, microwave popcorn does. And this is such an easy switch. I just use a pan that like I know that's gonna kinda get this way. It's just a stainless steel one. It's like my popcorn pan, but I use organic popcorn kernels and then organic coconut oil and then the real Redmond salt. And it tastes amazing. Anytime we have company over, people love the popcorn. So, definitely recommend this as a healthy, healthier option. Okay, I need to find the lid before that starts to pop. Just a little. There you go. She loves her coconut oil. Sometimes, not always, but sometimes I give her just a teeny tiny bit to eat. because I would really like to enjoy a few days with the presents because because I would really like to enjoy a few days with the presents under the tree